but then there was no episode when the year started. Um, to our audience, I think we can try from now going forward or every week we drop at least one episode. But now that we're back, um, we're going to try to make this one interesting, Yan, in terms yeah. of the theme of the entire podcast, anyway. So, how is this one going to be interesting? Uh, Pedagogies with my money in Zia actually focuses on making life easier for because we're living in a country where unemployment rate is so high. Actually, what is um, what is by today? What is unemployment rate? Uh, and so th- let me check first. First, okay. We're living in a country where unemployment rate is so high. I, I think I want to like. Unemployment it, uh, rate. Wanna, let's get from 2022 because that is the most accurate, right? It's 32.7%. 2023, they don't have statistics yet. This, resp- this, resp- this report is by uh, the 28th of February 2023, which is uh, our financial year when it ends. So um, it's 32.7. But the, the, you know, like what I went for is. Is it catching? What I went for was the one for 2023, and the one for 2023 says that the estimated one in 2023 it's aimed to hit 35.6 percent, meaning it's getting higher because yours says 32, right? But yours on what date? Because this one it's from statistics as statistics that's SA. and it was uh published on the 28th of February 2023, which is like. That's our financial year then. Mine but is... it should have anything to do with our financial year, but then it's fine. Yours, yours is, is mine thing. is also within the financial year, but it's it's a World Economic Forum. So, like, it's, like, But is it, a South, Af- is it a South African one? It's worldwide. It's, like, what they are depicting, like, in terms of the world. Okay. This is one, they're not, like... This one is from States SA. So you trust stats is a uh, because in South Africa stats is a they are the only people who publishes data fairly. Like yes, I do trust okay. statistics. Okay, SA. so let's cancel mine. Yeah. <laughs> if it, let's cancel. But mine, besides, then. besides, we talk about unemployment rate in South Africa. Anyway. Okay, let's work with yours. Yes, yeah, it's cool. Let's leave the world. The world. Yeah, because obviously, because obviously, that to say hasn't. Um, we are the children. I'm mean, okay. No, I'm stop <laughs> that. say hasn't done the one for 2023 because they're still collecting data right now for 2023. It, it, it is no, it is, it is. This one was published on the 20 on the 28th of February 2023. But okay, now we are. Where are we now? Okay, it, it, okay, sharp. Okay, sharp. R is not as accurate as it could be. Okay. But it's fine. For now, we have 32.7 yeah, unemployment yeah. rate. Yeah. Of which, if you can stretch it and then you put it on the youth, the youth, it's even like stretches longer. So it's more of the youth that is unemployed mm. than other people because they secured job from body transnet and what, 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 when they were younger and mines. Because <laughs> it's old mm, people that are working. <laughs> No, I never name. I never mentioned any name, any any company name. But the trans name is not a company name. Oh, ah well, it's a ah well. Press it all, but that, still, don't mention it. Doesn't, doesn't matter. I think it doesn't matter if you can. You can mention anything you want to mention based on. I mean, it's a podcast, it's not <laughs> FM. <laughs> like, <laughs> okay. Anyway, so what is the main point in terms of what you're saying? So the unemployment rate is thirty two point seven in terms of yes, and because like we can't do much, like we might to cr- like I feel like um, everyone dream they can create jobs, mm. or besides creating jobs, everyone dream they can get a job or just because income. Un- How about income? Not even job. Besides, un- unemployment unemployment means no food. Oh, unemployment means no food. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong now? Hey, no, you you pulling out you pulling out those. Words. Hey, okay, fine. Okay. So unemployment means no food. <laughs> <laughs> Just relax, chill. You should chill. You should chill, this one. But because I'm trying to maintain. Okay, fine. Mm. 
So unemployment means no food, um, no social life, which leads to depression, which leads to not feeling important enough to the community, which leads to self-termination. But okay, sharp. That, that, that's too deep. <laughs> that's too deep. I'm taking it too far. I'm taking okay. it too far. Yeah. But but my point being like your man, uh, the whole unemployment, like job being a, like not having an income is hard, or depending on three fifty per month. Well, that's that's yeah, that's the that's if you qualify. <laughs> that's if you qualify. If you get a baby, then you get how much you get when you get a baby? When you get a baby, one for one baby, no, for one baby, no, that's not lying. Let's not lie. No, one, the one, one thousand something. No, the, the thousand something is for it's for old people. Oh, it's for old people, not for the babies. For the babies, it's like around five hundred rands. Oh my goodness! Uh, Last time I checked. The baby is like you can't because like, because <laughs> you can't survive with five hundred. Okay, sharp. Baby. The only way you can get a thousand for babies is if you make two or three. Okay, sharp. Or four. But imagine <laughs> like, we have one baby and like now we are in Sasa, like we like we're trying to depend on that. One point five hundred rand is not enough because five hundred rand you not get it alone. Uh yeah, it's five hundred rand. It just increased by ten rand. So, so it's five ten. <laughs> no, it's not a laughing mate. I'm not laughing. No, yeah, I'm not yeah, laughing at the. I'm not. No, I'm not laughing at the amount. I'm laughing at how you thought it was a thousand. Mm. So, but, but if you have two years, you do get a thousand. Mm. But imagine you are a sasa mother, or you are unemployed, but then you learn how to use the internet. And then, because like there are some things which the government sometimes I'm looking at the time now it's four minutes. There are like some ways where the government tried to like yo man, if you can do this, every each and every department in government have procurement. So I'm gonna put it like this: procurement. It's a it's like uh, in a private company, I would say um, a buyer and a seller. Like people who buy things for them, people who order things for them, people who, who like uh, whatever whatever they need to buy, it must be processed and be and and someone must make a payment of those. And then South African government have come up with a way. They have come up with a way where like if you are a youth and you are unemployed, I don't know if they are really doing it for the youth. It doesn't really matter. It's not like age category, Kali related whatsoever. But then you get to like. Um, Open your own company, and then you can do some small energy jobs that the government might need. Like, for instance, the Department of Energy, they can say we need someone who can go buy for us fifty thousand pens, for instance. Yeah. And then, uh, or they say you want someone to go buy uh, one hundred and twenty boxes of A four books for whatever, 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 or, or um, exam pad or printing papers or whatsoever, stationery. It gets big. They can say, if you have a van, you can come dispose our um, trash. Just dispose our trash for us in a form of... Uh, so they send you an email, like, request for bid, but only when you have an existing company. But then now... Uh, the reason why we're making this episode, welcome, by the way, to uh, Pedagogies with uh, Mr. Maimane and Zia, to our audience out there. The reason why we're making this episode is like, wanna help someone out there, given that you feel like, yo, man, I don't have a way to have man to have like, to, I don't know, like, how do I put this? I don't have ways to can hustle or no jobs, uh, I'm unemployed. Or I could be employed, I'm not making enough, I need to make extra something like that but then like there are ways where like uh, our government out there they've provided ways where you can procure not you can procure but then um each and every department out there they have ways where they want someone to can do some small langana run some small langana for them i would say it's a tender but then 
categorize under smaller tender because they are bigger tenders. Because I've been wanting to say, is that a tender? Is that yes, a tender? Yes, I would say it's a tender. Is, but is it not? <laughs> it, 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 is. it is a tender. It is a tender. Okay. But then it's just that you have to start somewhere, right? Uh, Pella, remember, now we're talking about someone who's broke. Mm. A tender. The thing is, before I get to how this thing is done, let's go from how it begins. Yeah. Because it's pointless to can like fairly fairly go to the whole story. Okay. So how it starts is step number one. We have the so called C I P C. Okay. Uh so now are we looking up what C I P C stands for? No, there's there's another one. I just want the alternative of it. Okay. Also. I wanna, I wanna put, cause I'm gonna put the links anyway. So I wanna put, I wanna have both of them. It's the C A P C and put something, something bees. Um, bees portal, yeah. So it's the IPC and Beast Portal. Every yeah. Beast Portal, is Portal is where you find the things for the... Um, no. The procurement vibes. No. What is Beast Portal? Um, both of them, uh, CIPC and Beast, Port- and Beast Portal, they both work together. Beast Portal, I started to know about it during, lo- during lockdown. Yes. Uh, the CIPC, I remember that CIPC eSavices po- uh, website was down. That's when they told us if you want to update something, you must go to uh, Biz, Port- Biz mm. Portal. So Biz Portal is also a government website. Yes. The nice thing about Biz Portal is like it's it's more advanced than CIPC. So Biz Portal it also helps you to can even open a bank account, business open business account inside there. But now before we get there, okay. Um, the most uh, the popular one is the one yeah Isavis, the one yeah. Um, yeah, CIPC, CIPC, by the way, stands for Companies and Intellectual Property Commission, of which is the main, it's the main stakeholder, I would say, stakeholder, DTI, Department yes, of Trade, trade Industry. Yeah, yes. in terms of monitoring, com- excuse me, in terms of monitoring companies. So, step number one, a lot of people might pay someone money to do it for them, but then if you do it yourself, you can go to CIPC, and you, re- you create your own account. Mm. When you create your account, now I'm teaching you if you want to do it. But then to our audience out there, <laughs> actually. The <laughs> Civil audience. Okay, be my audience. Yeah, like, I'm your audience. Hello. But no, man. Like, yes, what if I want to do it? Okay, Shab. Let me teach you then. Yes, <laughs> You're gonna cut this part. Yo, man. Okay, so, um, it's the IPC, ne? And then, so, step number one, you create an account, right? With CIPC, ne? With CIPC. Yes. When you create an account, and then you're going to then, um, after you create an account, they'll give you a customer code. Your customer code is always going to be your reference whenever you want to deposit money into your CIPC account. Yeah. How do you deposit money into your CIPC, into your CIPC account? Yes. Uh, there's a, uni- there's a uh, I almost said universal. There's, a, there's an account which they use national. It's an APSA account. You just Google, uh, C- like if you go to Google now and you say CIPC account, it's going gonna, it's gonna to pop up. Mm-hmm. Just see, It's an APSA account. You just say CIPC. But the, anyway, PC. CIPC gives you that those banking details ne? anyway. Yes. yes. Like they send it in the SMS. When you register their company? Yes. No. no. When, when, like, but then oh, what yeah. if I don't trust going to Google? No, but you have to because... It's legit. Oh, is that how I reach the remember? The, remember, the details? remember when you deposit money on an ATM or wherever you do, they confirm what's the, what 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 organization are you depositing the money to. Mm. So you will know. 
after you enter that bank account, it shows like boop, there's a pop up, there's a pop up that like shows that your man, this is like all the banks lately. Whenever you deposit money, oh, it's it's a beneficiary. It's added as a beneficiary. Well, if you want to do an EFT, yes, yeah, it's part of those. It's the part of those that should be yes, because it's one account for everyone. The yes. only way to differentiate where the money is going, it's your reference, which is your customer code that you get yeah. when you create the account. Yes. And your your customer code now becomes your login, um, your login. The yes, no. the one you log in with. Okay. Yeah. So, step number one. So now we have the customer code, and then, like I say, to open a company is not two point five. Mm. It, it might it's 175 175 yes now after opening creating an account now you know how to log in and out of your cipc or you can use peace portal but still you might have to do the very same process and we create an account first before you log in mm. and like like i said any other thing you have to create an account before you log in even the business world but then now <laughs> i don't want to go back there because i'll deviate again so now you create an account and then you go, you deposit 175 or 200 rand roughly into that APC account using that account number. Because, like I said, if you don't trust the account number, you can use an ATM to can confirm the name. But otherwise, trust me, the one that when you Google uh, CIPC account number, it's an APSA account number that starts with 40555, whatever, whatever. Uh, I can even put the account number. Yeah, yeah, just yeah. put them there. Some yeah. of the things I'm talking about, I'm just going to to our audience or whoever who's watching this, some of the things that I'm talking about, I'm just going to pop them up here and there. But other than that, that's step number one, and then you, you deposit the 175 into the account. And then, from there, inside there, it's going to show you, like, your man, you press here to create a name, and then to to reserve a name is like 50 rands, and then to create the company, it's actually 125 it's 125 so that's why it's 175 in total okay from then i get it now you are unemployed you're trying to come up with a way to can hustle for yourself without having to like while you're still waiting for a job yeah. or we're still waiting for cvs or anyone to reply whereas if it might work out you might not even have to look for a job anymore because you have ways to can like eat because Oxalayo, we have to eat your yeah and it could be also like you might be employed but then you're not happy with what you're doing and like yo man you can't take a risk and living so we're living in a world where it's jobby job you don't just you can't live without having anything to do Joe. and besides unless they fire you which is unfortunate <laughs> or they retrench you or the yo but retrenchment is because now the organization is doing bad yeah, but still, still it's, a not, bad it's, it's, it's not. It's no. It's no. Bo- it's nobody's fault. Retrenchment is nobody's fault. But if the fire is your fault, yeah. Yeah, if, not 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 necessarily, but it it like it involves one person. Mm, okay. Retrenchment is 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 merely if they retrench you and only you alone. Well, it could depend on the size of the organization. But if they, they retrench you and it's only you alone, it could be they are firing you but in a nice way so you don't feel better about yourself. Yeah. <laughs> if you think so. <laughs> no, for real. They can't but retrench yeah. one person. In no. an organization, okay, they can't but retrench. that's besides the point. Well, they can. So, okay. They can, but given on the size of the organization, like I say. Yeah. But in a big organization, they retrench you and it's only one person they retrenched. Trust me. They could be firing you, but in a nice way. Okay. Yeah. But also to avoid that, thank you now now after having the IPC, now you have your own company, right? Yeah. Now the next thing is it's just the company stay chilling. What do you do to make it like to be like functioning Yana to in a South African citizen to can be like to can get those small tenders we're talking about? Step number two now. Mm. You might do it yourself. You can and get now I'm pushing to the one like now you have where you suppose you have Wi-Fi, you have a laptop, or you merely have a phone. Remember, phones are laptops also. Like phones, they do everything that a laptop can do if you know how to use a phone right. If you don't, you can learn how to use your phone from YouTube itself, I guess. Yeah, <laughs> if you want yeah. to. Yeah. So uh step number two would be like to go to SARS. You log into SARS and then you register your company with SARS. Mm. You know what that does? Mm-mm. You're able to get the so-called um, 
Text Learning Certificate. Okay. Have you ever seen it before? You can put it here. <laughs> no, but when I you when I you have it, I only know my text number. Like that's the it, only. It looks very. It's, it looks more or less the same. The same. Yeah, it's the same. It's okay. just that the difference is yours has your name, and then that one what they do. But no, like there's this other one. There's this other one with key. What 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 what? You also have the personal one eh? with a long password. F what 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 D what 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 what. Because I changed my password on my personal, so I don't know. Okay, sharp. They just look the same with the logo because they are all from SARS. Yes. But I think they differ. Yeah, man. I'll put the template in another show. Yeah, example. I'll show. Put something there. I'll show you. I'll show you how it looks like also. Okay. Yeah, and then you get that one. And then after you get that one, and then uh, step number three, um, I, th- I think I'm still on the, yes. I'm still on the on the thing. Yeah. Yeah. Step number three now would be a business bank account. You can choose whichever bank you want to open your business bank. But account. which one do you which one do you prefer as to like is the best? I wouldn't the bank? Pre- uh, like. I shouldn't in terms of a business account, like for, I, for I, a I, bank. I, I wouldn't put any recommendation in such. I would say I would say the cheapest. Mm. I would say the cheapest in terms of this. I don't want to promote any bank or anything yeah, like that. But yeah. then I would say the cheapest. Yeah. That would cost you less in terms of because when you start Monthly a business, rate. when you start a business, you don't have, you, like sometimes you just like for now we're just opening a company. You don't even know if you're gonna be selling mingos, oranges, yeah. or whatsoever. Yeah. But then we're talking about that thing of hustling through RFQs. Mm. Request for quotes where the government they're like, "Yo, man, please buy us papers, please buy us pens, please." So now you just opening a company to can merely do a bit of thing, and I always say whenever you do that, that's when your career will always choose you from there. <laughs> that's in my, a lot of people that I've seen. If someone delivers fruits, they end up opening a fruit shop <laughs> somehow. Like I'm mm. just I'm, from my from my observation from those that whom I've seen doing the thing. Yeah, you end up getting chosen from there. Like which one do you want to do? Because they just gonna because they give you a bit of everything. Today you can be doing stationery. Tomorrow you can be delivering things for constructions. Tomorrow you can be delivering pots and stoves and whatever. The, tomorrow they can want you to come fix their aircons and stuff. Yeah. And it gets to a point where even if you can't do that thing, you can get someone who knows how to do that thing and then you give them the you like you subcontract them, and then you share a certain percentage together. So you mm. see, like it works. True, given that you understand how the internet works, and then you understand how to like uh, actually bid. Because they send you an email, like we request you to make a quotation of whatever, whatever. Are you able to do this? And okay. then like, yo, man, I can do this. And then if you can, and then they give you the job. But here's a catch. I'm still posting on my steps. So I spoke, I spoke, I spoke about step number one for registering the IPC to um, uh, step number two. It was SARS. Step number three is the bank account. Now let's post that before I go to step number four. Um, the catch is when they give you that job to do, you must have someone at least. Because now, if you're not um, if you're not employed, you don't have money. Because what they do is they don't pay you to do the job. They give you the tender to do the job. So if they say buy us five beers, not beer, <laughs> mangoes, <example>. five mangoes. <laughs> five mangoes. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? What's going on now? <laughs> And they say buy us five mangoes. Mm. <laughs> oh no, let's use stationery. If they say buy us five pens, yeah, yeah, you have to go buy them five pens. So five pens, uh, it would be ten rand to buy right. five pens because one is two rand. Yes. And then from then you must somehow calculate how much labor is going to take you to deliver the five pens to them. You put yeah. it on the quotation. And then you must also pay yourself thirty percent of the amount of the pens, and then you put it in quotation. So if you buy five pens for them for ten rands, and then your quotation can come and say, "Your man, it was supposed to be fifteen rands, but then I'm gonna give you a discount of fifty cents." Now the total amount that you have to pay me is fourteen rands forty-five, and then they're like, "Okay, sharp, we approve, do the job," and then you go, you buy the pens for them with your own money. Mm. Now that's where the catch is, because now when they give you a job and you don't have money to do the job, and then so basically you must have 
uh, you must have uh, your own capital. Like you must have something on your side, even if it's five rand, so you can be able to make a ten rand. Is that basically? Yes, in a way. But then also, you might you might want to have a relative nyana, you know. But a friend nyana, a friend nyana, a business partner nyana. But 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 it doesn't always work like that. But then there are some. I would like to. Whenever you say, okay, sharp. Let me go to step. Let me finish the steps because now we're gonna do, we're gonna talk about those downfalls and everything okay. to cover the whole thing because now I feel like we're skipping most of the important parts of the of, of the whole thing. Okay. So after you open the business account, step number four is now you register your business, your company as it is. You register it into CSD. CSD stands for Central Supply Database. As for every Every organization that renders a business in South Africa, it is registered and it is registered under CST. Yeah, you can register yourself, or you can go yourself go the Department of Treasury. I may not know uh, how many offices of Treasury do we have in South Africa, but then I know the one in Pretoria, it's in CBD. But uh, Department of Treasury, Department of Treasury, the one in CBD, they have an office at the back. Where they have um, they monitor things that have something to do with like tenders and whatever, whatever. So if people don't know how to use the computer, they normally go there to create an account as CST, and then that's when you register what your business is gonna be doing, what it's gonna be about, whatever, whatever. And people, some people they cheat the system. What they do is they just put everything like. My business is education, whatever, 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 whatever. And then they mix, mix masala, mix yeah. masala. And then they put all the relatives' address all over the country. So now, whenever they send them emails, like, we request you to bid for this. Can you buy us 50 windows from what, 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 what? Can you buy us whatever? So if you are registered under CSD, you could be chilling and then you automatically just receive an email, say, yo, this is the department of what, 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 what. We need you to buy us uh, lighting bulbs for a building which is that's newly they just built the building recently and we need bulbs for 100 floors whatever, yeah. whatever this size this voltage and then they like sign here if you're going to accept and then say no if you can't so that's when if you don't have the money because that uncle that you trusted whom you thought you're loaning the money from to can help you do the job so you can pay him whatever percentage you get after you do the job <laughs> It is what it is, man. <laughs> and that's like, yo, I can't do the job. <laughs> and then they decided no. But all in all, that's how. So those are the four steps. Oh, so it's only four steps. So let's recover then. So the here, first here day, you like are, here you are. When you, I, I can use the word. I mean, this one is not. It's not grade eight. <laughs> yeah, but let's recover the, the steps. Like, let's go yes. over them again. So, here you are. <laughs> and then you feel like, yo, man, I want to open my own company. Now, this one is for the audience. For the audience. For the, for the, for audience. the audience. For the audience. Yeah. <laughs> so, here you are. And you want to open a company. Step number one. You have to go to the website. Yeah. CIPC. Key. Okay. E services, e services, cipc dot gov dot z a, yeah, or pod biz, biz portal, biz portal, yeah, yes, me, biz me. portal, or biz portal, mm. but biz portal it also guides you. Biz portal is more friendly user than e service, but then they are both fine. It doesn't okay. matter whichever one you do. Whenever, cause cause biz portal can also assist you with SARS, and also with uh. I'm not sure with SARS, no, I'm lying, but it assists you. It uh, it assists you with uh open with uh, the choice of the business account you might want to choose, and then they give you an advice on how to go. Wara, 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 wara. But yeah, uh, CIPC, and then step number two, you fix your you register your business with SARS. You can go there straight. You can go to any of your nearest officer SARS. Maybe if you do that for the first time, then you'll be able to do it after. But otherwise, you can log in and still do it yourself without having to go to SARS, depending on how you know how to work around your computers. And that's step number two. Mm. Step number three, you go to the bank. Now you have your company ID. Like, after you open a company, it's going to give you this document that has seven pages. Well, 
I don't know if I'll could be more, it's could be less. Nah, nah, it's seven. Or seven. Oh, it's yeah. mainly seven. Okay. Because <laughs> like, <laughs> you were just like you're looking like you're no, doubting. Just, I just thought I was gonna put the, but I'm like I can't put pictures of everything, man. Yes. I can't put pictures yeah, of everything. Yeah, you can't. But yeah, but from those seven pages, the most important ones that they want is the last three pages. Mm. That's page number four, five, and, no, five, six, and seven. Okay. They're the ones that you bring. So it's more like an ID. Like those yeah, they to verify as, that this is a business yes, now. Yes. So like they're like if it was an individual, is that business ID? Mm. And so the SARS uh, document also together with that one, you take them to the bank. Mm. That's where they are able to open a business account for you. Without the SARS or without the ID, they can't like like the company like the, yeah, the business account. The business, the business account won't exist. Okay. So after having the business account, now your your, your company is set. Mm. That's when you register it into the CSD, and then from the CSD, CSD Central Supply Database. Data, database. Yeah. Yes. Not Central data. Supply Database. Once you register there, and then now you so much ready to can receive any email, yeah, a job to do. But then you don't have to wait for the emails. There's also a dope one also. Mm. You're not ready for this one. Mm-hmm. Okay, so I'm, I'm joking. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you see, I'm, I'm getting warmed up. I'm yeah, like, now yeah, you're like becoming I'm like... I'm <laughs> So now, you don't have to necessarily wait for the emails. Because now, suppose you're desperate. Because sometimes, you do these things because you're a man. These things have to be done. But then sometimes, you just get an email and then you get it. You get you just code for something and then actually get the job and then just do it while you have other things that you're doing. Um, if you feel you want to make this your hustle for every day, you can wake up every day and open. There's a website called eTender. I'm, I'm also going to put the link somewhere Okay. Here. So there's a website, yeah, eTender. You go there. You can search for, like, there are categories. Stationary, delivery, general, whatever. Some, they want accreditation. Like, also, when you have a company... As you grow, you're gonna accredit. You're gonna put some accreditations. I think this episode can be done like as much as yeah. I, yeah. Time. I can't. I can't talk about everything in one episode. Yeah. I'm gonna break it down into like whatever. But then there's a lot to be like. There's a lot you can play around in your own computer. So now we have four tabs open. You wake up in the morning, open a laptop. You open a laptop if you have. If you're unfortunate not to have. A laptop you can also use a phone because like i always say your a phone is, it can be a laptop a phone too. is a computer man yeah. like i think we must we must make we must make a also. bit more tricky like in terms of like size and everything but still it still works the same but like you didn't discuss like the fact that like the what about the certification like the broad uh broad based black economic empowerment you didn't like touch on that oh yeah the bee certificate yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm not following. I'm not following the. I closed. I was just. I just went. Uh, that's the last one. Because the one that isn't that important to like. It is. Because like B B E, you know how B E. Um. Because uh, now again to our audience, when you submit, when you submit, uh, when you submit a quotation, if they send you that thing like your man, we need you to buy us fifty pence or whatever, whatever and then you accept the workshop. Let me try to submit the code. Number one, you're gonna create some sort of a page called this high thing mm. that shows your code, like how much you're gonna charge them. That that one I was telling you about, like discount, what, 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 and then it's gonna have your company logo. Those things that is it, 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 like the logo. It, you don't even have to go big, like you don't have to go big and say like go pay someone three hundred rand. Yeah, or saying yeah. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> simplified as is deep. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> you can create simplified RSA ka, 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 Microsoft to it. Okay. I'm just saying. I'm not gonna <laughs> you can you can like like you see the you see the stick, it can be aligned with the other things. No, let, that one mm. let's leave that on the side. I'm just saying you don't necessarily have to go big with the logo. You can just make your logo a name in capital letters. That could be your logo. So now I'm just saying like the quotation must be in a way that it shows that there's some efforts that were placed because you are a company, right? Mm. Even though you're trading from your own room with your own laptop, but then you are your own company, which is like now the government needs you to go buy them 
stationary man they want pants 50000 pants okay. you must bring them to them and for, for you to make it until it shows like it's true you, even if you deliver them with a the wheelbarrow that's how your company I'm I'm joking I, I thought the word I, cut this part this is what's <laughs> happening no i've never seen anyone delivering <laughs> But PE certificate. <laughs> yeah. So what does it mean? Like, what does PE mean? No, I mean, uh, like in well, terms of the. To, uh, you see now PE. We have to Google it. I can. I can use my own words. I'm gonna. Kaloko, like, and it when in terms of your experience, in terms of the business that you already have, like your own company, like PE, is it about like black? Is it but about was, black was, people? Who said I have my own company? Oh, okay. <laughs> For real, though. <laughs> <laughs> For real, though. I have my own company. Okay, so let's go. Oh, they, call it, they call it B, B, B. It's, it's oh, B, it triple, triple B. It's B dash double B E E certificate. And it's free of charge. But do you know people pay for it because they don't know how to generate it themselves? That thing of paying, like, really, guys. And, 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 and B, BBE is on Biz Portal, actually. That's what I'm seeing here. Yes, yes. Even on CIPC, you're able to generate it from the... Like, on CIPC, there's an option. Because the way CIPC is divided, ne, it, it's home, transact, and something, something. I forgot the last... Okay, let me check, let me check. Did what, you know, like, here, I'm seeing on the website, actually, it's saying that, please note that CIPC B dash b b e e certificates are free of charge yes like you don't have to be paying like yes like scam artists yes. vibes but people pay for it uh no it's free of charge yo like if you can become wise and like follow even, even oh. my cousin even my cousin gave me 200 rand to generate one for him and I, we never even finished the process but then i ate the money no but we're cutting this part out <laughs> 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 that <laughs> I cut. I'll teach him how he stands. So mm. <laughs> cut, Sana. The two hundred will be for the lessons. Cause he, he said it's like it was like, eh, you know how to do this. I'm like, yeah. He's like, how much I gonna charge me? I'm like, yo, man, I'm not gonna charge you anything. I was like, you know what? Let me buy you two beer. Let me buy you a uh, beer so you can like. Well, it, this part it, it, it gets worse, ne? It gets What's worse the beer? Uh, yeah. Okay, shop. Anyway. Anyway, <laughs> I'm wrapping this up now. Did we get everything that you wanted to like depict to your to your audience? No, but but we're not. Is done. It re- we're oh. still on. We're still on something. No, CSD summary, like everything you got, it, Joe. So I, I said. What are what are the things so to submit? You need a quotation. I never said anything about CBDs. Okay. No SBDs. Because I'm like. Okay. Yeah. 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 I'm like um, after you go to e and then you find the tender that you want, whichever you're interested on to submit to submit the final one, you need um, the gonna need you like to like SBDs. What does SPD stand for? Like, every time I Google what SPD is, I feel so stupid when I get the meaning. SPD stand for... SPD stands for standard binding document. So it's those documents will be like, I don't have a criminal record. I've never done what, 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 what. I've never done. Like I, the, the, the typical um, job description, like when you go for a job as well, they also ask you for those kind of things. Yeah. So every job, it comes like we have SPD 1, SPD 2, SPD, I'm not sure, but it's 1.1, 1.1.2, 1.5. It's like there's a lot of different SPDs. 
So every every job that they give you, they want you like this one you submit it. They give you the requirement. You must give us your tax clearance, BBE certificate. So now the BBE certificate, okay, Sharp, yeah, that's also the one where we were not we never went up, we never went deep about it. It's the one where you state, Hori, are you a black owner? So it works like this. Level one BE certificate is the strongest. And then level two, like level three. Like so Kanyana, so yeah. if you are level four, I'm level one. The way uh, it works in terms of those tenders, uh, I'm more favored than level four because it's white owned because they are white privileged. Remember, the whole point of doing this is to create jobs. And the most unemployment rate is on black people. So B is certificate that is strong is level one. Level one is when it's 100% owned. That is 51% and above of black people. So even if there could be one, like it could be level one, they can have few nyana white people matter as long as it's 51% or up. If it's 50% and less, and then it's level two. And then it goes like that further and further and further and further. So now, if Wakawate ha already, you can, I get now a company who know like now business, I don't want to go back, I don't want to go deep into business mothers, the soul uh where you like doing it only one and then there's the other one where like now you can add a, a lot a lot of people whatsoever where they have shares and stuff either way um your be certificate it is gonna be like if it's three people it's you your dad and your mom uh you're gonna say now we have 33 percent female oh, okay maybe if you and your mom now is 66 percent female Thirty three percent me. Male. Yeah. This percent this percent what 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 old. This percent younger. This number unemployed. Also disabled. disabled. You, must, yeah. you add, you add, yeah. you add, you add. And then when you add all those things and then they build and then they make your BE certificate to be strong. So whenever they consider if you were to bid for the same kinda tender, it would be consider this you the guys one, more yeah, yeah. the more who are diverse. Not diverse as such. Level one would be more considered than level three, for instance. Okay. Yes. But okay, level one, and it depends on that. The fact that level one is more diverse than the one who who's only like men in level three, right? Like. Well, the, yeah, it does go as further as females, males. Yeah, there must be diversity. Yeah, like yeah, there must be like yeah, yeah yeah. But all in all, it's like BE certificate. It's also considered for you to bid for attend so you're gonna submit a couple of standard binding uh documents sbds given what which ones do they want like i say we have up from spd1 up to spd9 and they have subdivisions mm. spd1.1.1 spd whatever, whatever whatever and then from then uh you're gonna have to have uh the quotation typed by you with your company logo how much you're gonna charge them how much whatever you're gonna buy the pens for if you are buying pens how wha, how much uh is your interest how much is your but you don't count the interest as such but how much is the labor and then you just give them the entire amount they're gonna decide if they accept it or not okay. you don't have to undercharge you don't have to overcharge, overcharge. because just you can be, be like, desperate you yeah. can be desperate to be like let me make it cheaper like it doesn't it because they want quality they don't want uh some sort of sympathy or i let me like Mm, you know because mm. understanding that everyone might feel like yo man if i do it like this i'm gonna make more so um yeah, yeah so those are the things which you should consider you don't have to charge less and you don't have to charge more you just have to be like standard luena you must benefit that's the whole point because you're unemployed and trying to make something for yourself so you must put exactly 30 percent but don't be greedy and also yeah, don't, don't, like chow everything for yourself don't yeah. be too needy yeah yeah and then uh those SP, those those uh spds the the standard binding documents mm. one of them i don't know which one i think it's spd six or seven it even ha- it even has, an, has some sort of an equation so it can help you calculate some sort of points which you can learn i'm going to create a video for that separately where you can okay. learn how to see if you are overcharging or you are undercharging. Yeah. And like, mind you, remember, they, like the tenders differ on this one is going to make more than this one. This is going to make less than this one. But mostly when you just open a new company, 
you're not gonna get jobs that can exceed maybe two hundred thousand rand. It's mm. still gonna be like just the other net one. But then like now, to our audience out there, you're doing this because you're desperate, right? You don't have mm. a job or you have less income. You just wanna add from what you're earning. But the disadvantage is that when you are working for a government, you can't do these things. You can't. You can't. You can't do RFQs. So you only in your private, in your own, in your own private company, like that's when you can do it, not public. Normally, even if you do it in a private company, they, I don't think they really care as long as you are at, you are, you are doing their work all the all the time, but. The thing is, with um, if you register in CSD, most mostly, or oh, the CSD monitors the tenders that are like produced or like that are like given by the government. So if you work for the government, you're not allowed to do tenders. That because it would be because now you are inside, it would be easier to do some sort of nepotism uh, or corruption or whatever because you are yeah. inside already. Yeah. So a government official is not allowed to do such. Okay. Yeah. That's why people, whenever they want to cheat it, they register their families. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. They do that. <laughs> like they do that. But it's just, I feel like corruption is there anyway. Okay. So, in a perfect world, this is for someone who's unemployed entirely. Mm. If you work for, but a, even if you like, you can do it as a side hustle too. Like if you if you employed, like you can do it as a side hustle too. Yeah, but given like, that given that you're not employed the by main, the government. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Not by the government. Because the, yeah, but look, you can you you can you like you can get tenders from private companies. Mm. I'm saying to re, to be registered under CSD to get tenders which you are registered under CSD central mm. database central supplier database mm, mm. you don't have to be a government official like whenever all government employees they make them sign a document that says your man don't do this man I abide myself not don't to be on the side yeah no, not not to hustle on the side. They don't care whatever if you hustle on the side. They just don't want you. Don't contravene their policies. No, you just don't do tenders. It's a government. I get it. The the policy is don't do tenders, right? You can you can has you can sell eggs in Archer and Archer. What if I get a tender to do eggs? So what if that's my hustle, like to sell eggs on the side, and then you like, can you get know? that tender somewhere else privately. It shouldn't be. From Evident. other government, government entities. Yes. Okay. Yes, that's the limitation. It's not that deep, but it is deep. <laughs> okay, Mister My Money, we hear you. So, is that all the news that you've brought for us today? Like, is that what's happening today? I feel like you're ending it, ne? Like we're done for today. <laughs> Do you feel like you're done? I felt like I still what I had. I Dude, can no, bruh. No. I no. can preach. But it's so fine. I don't want to like so all in all, until everything. That's okay. So like all in all, um there is something you can do perhaps if you feel like your man while well, you're waiting for that job or you're waiting for that um position. Or you feel like you just wanna make something extra for yourself. There is something that you can do. It would be Try maybe to do those smaller yana tenders yana that the government offers uh, for the unemployed and for those who are struggling with life. So that was it for today. Uh, please subscribe and like our videos. And uh, comment. And comment. Um, 